I love stray kids, but Chongbin is a bit. I am a stay. Oh wow, who's your bias? Bias? I only know Felix and Hyunjin. Do you follow stray kids on Instagram? Oh yeah, I do, see. Chongbin laughs too much. Chongbin doesn't fit with the image of stray kids. Baby girl, first of all, he has a face prettier than yours, has the body you want your boyfriend to have, has bank balance for which you could marry a 60 years old man, has better lifestyle than yours, so where is the problem? I think I should identify myself as a blind person, because no matter how much I try to see flaws in Chongbin, I never see one, or maybe his haters should register themselves in a mental hospital because there's 100% something wrong with how their brain works. A person who lays on the sofa all day long, got the guts to talk bad about a man who works 10 times better and harder than him or her. Let me tell you something interesting. There's a very thin line between hating and disliking someone. Most of you don't even know why you hate him. Maybe you just disliked him and then you fell in the gutter and started hating him for nothing. Maybe you're not a hater but an average K-pop stan who's into K-pop because of idol's pretty looks and not because of their talent, and you're still not ready to accept the fact that Chongbin completely transformed himself into a much hotter man that you can ever pull. Solo stans are a problem in almost every fandom and honestly I don't have any issues with people being solo stans as long as they don't disrespect the other members or balantly ignore them in front of the whole crowd. During TXD's recent fan sign event, a girl completely ignored Yeonjin and moved to Taehyun. Now this is something you shouldn't do as a solo stan, sitting in front of a group you stan, and not even looking at the man sitting in front of you is very disrespectful. There have been several occasions where so-called stays cheered for all of the members except Chongbin, and later on some people tried to cover it by saying that they couldn't see Chongbin because there was a pillar. They cheered for him but the phones weren't able to record it since they were really far away. The phone didn't record the cheers because only 10 out of 200 people cheered and you just want to cover it which is low-key toxic. If you search on Google, rules to follow as a K-pop stan, the first word you'll see there is respect, solo stans aka a K, literally means malicious solo individual stan who cares about one member and constantly sends hate or degrades the other members, their aim for the group is to disband or the member they stand to go solo, but if you're a solo stan, don't call yourself a fan of the group. For example if you're a fan of Han only, you're not a stay, you're just a Han stan. I came across this while searching up for the reasons why people love Chongbin, someone wrote. One of the reasons why I find Chongbin interesting is because he has a sense of humor, which may seem contrary to his very stern and serious look. He also may sometimes plays the shipper and may even hold secrets to some of the Skiz members. Looking at his reaction in some of the videos show us how he finds some of his members' behavior to be funny and amusing by way of his secret smiles. Long story short, he's hardworking, pretty, funny, cheerful, talented, determined, active, successful, good rapper, good dancer, good producer, a good friend, reliable, affectionate, ambitious, assertive, enchanting, kind, outgoing, mature, sensible, smart, wise, trustworthy, cute, muscular, confident and creative. If this is not enough for you to rethink your opinions about him, I don't know what is. I wish people start to see him as a kind and talented human rather than a man who doesn't fit in the Korean beauty standards. And just to let you know, I'm gonna report every single comment that says anything ill about him. So think twice before saying anything against him.